Hello everybody, Kokuru here, and today I'm going to talk a little bit about Valorant. So in the past, like, three days I started replaying Valorant because, I mean, I got banned for 14 days of League of Legends and I was like, hey, I will check other games, I'm playing Prince of Persia, I'm playing Prince of Persia Sands of Time, I'm gonna start playing Warrior Within tomorrow, but in the meantime, um... I'm also playing Valorant and it's been pretty fun, question mark. The game has evolved because I pretty much play it like once every year and I play like two or three games. Uh, what has happened to the game in the past like year and a half that I didn't play was adding a lot of champions that pretty much do anything and everything and it's kind of annoying having to have in mind that every legend can do pretty much anything at any time. They're having the same problem that every other game with a uh, champions is having. League of Legends has too many champions, Apex Legends has too many champions and they just keep piling up, piling up, piling up. I, I believe it would have been better if they basically redone some of the champions they already had instead of just building one million trillion thousand champions and in 20 years there being like 58 more champions plus 25 new champions and stuff but that's just a complaint that i have generally about games like these just more and more and more and more and more champions okay on to the other thing my ability on the game i feel like i've been really bad at the game because I haven't uh, done any shooting training in a while because usually when I played Counter-Strike Global Offensive when I actually tried to play for rank I went to train and I trained really hard and I got really good results I don't remember if MGM2 was my best rank or whatever but uh, I tried my best and I got good results if you practice your aim you'll get better in all of these shooting games no matter what and the range in Valorant is pretty good for training. I trained like like 10 minutes a day and Jesus Christ my aim improved quite a lot. Regaining all of that muscle memory that I had years ago is kind of really fun. Also, uh, yeah, I have to learn the champions. I believe the only champion I can play now is Neon. She's like the simplest champion, just press space to run to objectives, you camp out, you kill somebody and your ult is great because you don't have to buy a weapon that round, you can just go in with your ult and decimate everybody. My rank, I believe it's like bronze or silver, I'm talking about my legitimate rank, I, I don't know, uh, I'm currently I believe silver too, but I don't believe I'm silver two player the same way, I don't believe that I'm in League of Legends a bronze player, I'm... 100% a iron one player in terms of gameplay so yeah i mean um whatever uh, i'm gonna play for the foreseeable week maybe week and a half and i'm enjoying it the only thing i find cringe is that there are people who like require you oh you have to get your mic you get your mic you get your mic get your mic i don't need to get my mic man i, I can type in chat i don't have to televise everything that i do and everything that i see i can type fast just okay also there are a lot of women in this game question mark which gives me ptsd to the time where a woman roasted like th three of the other players on my team in counter-strike global offensive to the point where it was like i was witnessing a murder and she wasn't even using slurs <sighs> So anyway, uh, thank you for watching, um, I hope you... I actually don't hope anything, uh, I've lost all hope. I've watched the new episode of South Park, making fun of a lot of diet stuff, and also the American health system, and also Lizzo. And I've lost like 7 kilos in 40 days, and I've realized that I have to step my game up and lose a little bit more if I want to make my goal till September. But anyway, uh, thank you for watching. Uh, bye bye. I don't care. Mwah.